I'm Karen Randall from Randall's Farm and Greenhouse. Gardens start to come alive this month, and if you're ready, here's what you can plant. In our area, the last frost date is May 30th. This should be the safe date for tender vegetables and flowers to be planted. By tender, we mean plants that cannot live through overnight temperatures in the 20 and 30 degree range. Tender vegetables like tomatoes and peppers, beans and squash, annual flowers like petunias, geraniums, salvia and marigolds, and hanging baskets of flowers are all tender plants. An unusually warm month of March with temperatures in the 80s fooled us into thinking planting time was here. But you must trust the calendar, not the temperature. Freezing nights, hazardous to tender plantings, seldom occur after May 30th, but may happen unexpectedly any time up until then. What can we plant now, before the last frost date? All kinds of plants. Trees and shrubs benefit from April and May planting. Cool nights, sunny days, and springtime rain help them to get established with little stress. Perennial edibles, like strawberries and asparagus, along with berry bushes, thrive when planting in late April and May. It's time to plant vegetable plants that like cool temperatures. Lettuce, cabbage, broccoli, peas, and carrots. Hardy annuals like pansies. And perennial flowers, flowers that survive winter and come back year after year, can be planted now. It's also a good time to divide late season flowering perennials. It's a great month for cleaning up the yard and garden of last year's growth and leaves, adding new mulch and enhancing garden soils with compost to add valuable nutrients and keep the soil from drying out. Until May 30th, protect tender vegetable plants, flowering hanging baskets, and tender annual flowers, many just emerging from greenhouses, from spring winds and cool temperatures below 40 degrees. The weather may be tempting, but be mindful of the night temperatures and the calendar. Happy planting, I'm Karen Randall from Randall's Farm and Greenhouse.